Hello, Central Illinois. We can't wait for Friday. We have football Thursday, week nine tonight, and it's a big one. The Peoria City Championship on the line is Peoria High host Peoria Notre Dame tonight. What a night for Brady Asmolsky. Remember we had the story on the Peoria Notre Dame twins? Look at Brady go. He had a huge first half for the Irish. A touchdown right there out of that wing tee offense. Later, it's Brady Asmolsky again following those blockers up front. And run into daylight, 21-12 Notre Dame at the half. But the second half, it's last week's 25 sports athlete of the week, Eddie Clark, in the spin cycle. Woo! Look at him go. You wouldn't have even got him in flag football right there. Look at him go. Eddie's going all the way for a touchdown. Not just Eddie Clark coming out of that backfield. Deatric Pollard with a big, big play right here to give Peoria Hyde the lead. But Peoria and Notre Dame would come back. It kind of felt like one of those games, whoever had the ball last. Well, Peoria and Notre Dame goes right down the field this time. It's Alex Osmolsky, the other twin, running behind Drake Gibbs for a touchdown. Notre Dame's got a 35-32 lead. Peoria High is going to have one more chance. they got a great kickoff return from Eddie Clark. And with 35 seconds to go, Eddie Clark powers in for his fourth touchdown of the night. The game-winning touchdown, the Peoria City Championship touchdown. Lions win it 40-35. I'm proud that you battled to put your consistency on the field like we talked about. When we became consistent, we started gaining the edge little by little. You're a tough group, all right? Now you became a disciplined group, all right? You out-disciplined the other team tonight, and I'm so proud of you for that. That's the team we have to be going forward now. Peoria High will take a 7-2 record going forward to the playoffs. Peoria Notre Dame 6-3 going to the playoffs. Tomorrow on Football Friday, extended highlights of the big normal community, Normal West, Morton Dunlap game, all your highlights tomorrow on Football Friday. Then don't forget Saturday night, the football playoff pairings are unveiled to the entire state right from the studio. That's on the Peoria Blooms in the CW at 8 p.m. Tonight's semifinal night at the Heart of Illinois Conference Volleyball Tournament. Fieldcrest right here in action against the number one seed Tremont. Fieldcrest looking good early. Annabelle Fortner to Kaylin Reitz for the kill. But here comes Tremont. Whitney Rumble sets up the block. Then Mackenzie Flutterer with the roll shot. Turks win in two. Tremont is 26 and 2 on the season. Flutterer with that little roll shot. Semifinal number two, Eureka and Tri Valley. Sarah Hart had 30 assists. She goes back row to Holly McDonald for one of her 10 kills. It's going to be a big hit right here. Landry Warfield off the assist from Haley Warfield, but Eureka's going to get the win. Delaney Phillips pounds it down. Eureka wins in three. They'll play Tremont Saturday for the tournament title. Senior night at the Potter Dome and Morton hosting Dunlap tonight. We'll show off some of these seniors. Katie Krupa has been a standout since her freshman year, which she led Morton to a sectional title. She kills the overpass right there, Katie Krupa. Then it's going to be senior Leah Urban Trout outside to senior Olivia Pippen for the smash. Holy Moses! You know, Moses is a Morton High grad. A couple years older than me in school. He's old. Uh, but holy Moses, uh, here's Dunlap Mia Holmes to Emma Robin for the kill. But watch the hang time on Urban Trout. Watch Leah get up. Oh my gosh! She almost hit her head on the roof of the Potter Dome. Yeah, Leah, Potters are winners tonight in two. Metamora beat Canton to finish a 14-0 undefeated middle line. I see it's a great gym dandy for you. This is Dewan Smoot, former line.